We started by observing traffic on the roads for a very long time. And we observed traffic for an entire period of one month. And what we realized was that the nature of traffic was lopsided and was changing at a very fast pace, but the lights were static. And what I mean by lopsided is that one side of the road has far higher traffic congestion than the other lanes. So as you can see in the animation, what you can see over here is that the one lane which is going towards the city and going towards the office hubs has a far higher traffic congestion while the other lanes where there is no a, a less dense populated area there is very less traffic congestion so what we did was we simulated this environment and we gave each lane equal amount of time so 30 seconds 30 seconds of green time each and what we saw was that a lot of time was getting wasted and due to this, what was also happening was the entire city's traffic was slowing down. As you can see in the periphery, all the cars are moving at a slower pace than they should be because of the problem at the center. So if I look at the green part which is highlighted over there, you can see that there is very less traffic congestion over there. And that, car, that amount of congestion would take only 10 seconds to clear up. But on the other lanes where there is a lot more traffic congestion, we would need to give around 40 seconds. So what we decided to do was create an intelligent system that works on dynamic and real-time sensing of traffic densities to dynamically change red-green distribution at the lights. And in by doing this and by making a change to the junction, what we believe is we will be able to make a change to the entire city and solve the city's traffic problem. Thank you.